Another useful feature in both free and Chrome flexible shipping UPS plugins is possibility to choose UPS services. To do that, just go to your UPS shipping method settings. By default, all the UPS shipping services will be displayed to your customers. If you want to limit services or change their names, just check Enable Services Custom Settings. Now you'll see all UPS services. They are all enabled and have default names. If you want to limit some of them, just uncheck this field. Let me show you how it works. For example, I have many UPS shipping options in my cart and I want to limit some of them. So just go back to Shipping Method Settings, disable UPS Today services and save changes. From now, it won't be displayed for store's customers. You can also change names of the services and their order. For example, let's promote UPS standard service. To do that, just move it to the top of the list with simple drag and drop. Let's also change its name to just UPS. Save changes. And in my cart, simple UPS is the first shipping option. Very important feature connected with UPS shipping services is a fallback. You can set fallback flat rate cost that will be displayed for your customers if UPS returns no matching rates. To do that, just click on enable fallback and enter your flat rate cost. Let me show you how it works. So I disabled all the UPS services and now I have only fallback cost in my cart. And that's all for UPS custom services, but we have other useful materials about flexible shipping UPS plugin.